Hey guys, it's Chris from Destination Beer, hanging out in Fort Collins, Colorado. We're here for GABF week, and I uh, always like to visit uh, the local breweries, and so stopping by one of my favorites in Fort Collins, and uh, it's Funkworks. Uh, if you've never had their beer, you should definitely try it. So we're gonna take a tour of the brewery, gonna kind of show you around. Uh, there's the logo, and give you a quick tour of the brewery, and um, I'll let you kind of see what's happening uh, here in Fort Collins. So we got the limos here because we got VIPs coming in for JBF. That's the tasting room. We're actually going to finish our tour there. We're going to come up over here and take a, a really quick tour of the brewery. So coming up over here. And there is Gordon waiting for us right there. Hey, Gordon, how's, how's it going? going? Good. So this is Gordon. Gordon. Uh, him and his partner started uh, Funkworks uh, how long ago? Uh, well, 2009 we started uh, a business plan and we got things together. 2010 we were open. So. Okay, now yeah. well, let's take a tour of the uh, brew house here. So this is the brew house at Funkworks. And uh, we've got a lotter ton and a mash ton. So we got a 15 barrel brew house. Uh, the ability to do step mashing on this system. Uh, right now we're doing Tropic King. Okay. Uh, doing a 60 barrel batch of that. So we're going to walk times. up there and take a shot. Yeah, take a look. Okay. Always got to be careful on these steps. These are, I don't know why they make brew house steps so small. But, all right, so let's see here. We got our mash ton. Got some liquid in there. And let's see here. We got our lotter ton. And we can tell that uh, there's some lottering going on right now. See if we can get back down here without breaking anything, mostly me. All right, so this is uh, got some fermentation, fermentation tanks in front of us. Yep, everything moves from the brew house over to fermentation. Uh, so back here we have a uh, few 15 barrel fermenters, 30 barrel fermenters, and some 60 barrel fermenters. Okay. So. You guys, uh, for those of you that aren't sure what a barrel is, one barrel equates to two kegs, so that is uh, essentially 120 kegs, a half barrel kegs. Uh, the smaller kegs obviously got to be more. But so this is where uh, the wort be actually becomes beer. They pitch uh, the yeast into these tanks, and um, you don't see anything in there because well, it's empty and it's dark, which is what yeast like. Well, they like dark. They don't like empty. Um, so let's uh, continue walking through. So, more fermentation tanks. How many uh, barrels of beer can y'all make right now? Uh, this year we'll probably get about 6,000 barrels. 6,000, okay. Uh, by next year we're planning on about 9 to 10. Okay. So, so I know they just expanded distribution to Houston, which I'm very excited about. And uh, they are packaging today. So this is their bottling line. So they are, we are packaging today. Uh, raspberry Provincial right now. Okay. Uh, that is a super tasty beer. So some of those bottles may be on their way to a beer store near you. So we've got uh, some barrels here. Barrel aging projects going on over here. Mostly our our sours. A uh, few oh, no. non sours. And we've got our fooder uh, right oh, now. Nice. That's, that has uh, our wild saison in that. Kind um, of a new uh, test project we're doing. So. Very cool. Now, yeah. for those people that aren't familiar with a fooder, tell them what that is. Fooder is basically a gigantic barrel. Um, you know, that one holds about 30 hectoliters, which is about 25, 26 barrels of beer. Uh, but yeah, basically the advantage there is it's less um, oxygen ingress um, in a small barrel. Um, due to the, the volume versus uh, surface area. Cool. And how big is that one? That's a uh, 30 hectoliter, 25 barrels. Okay. Sure. So this is uh, part of the tasting room. This overflow. Lots and lots of barrels. And um, so we've got a little menu for uh, everybody to check out so they know what they want. We're going to walk up to the official tasting room. This is the best part of the tasting room. Yeah, we like tasting. We don't call it drinking, we like tasting. Look at this. We have some very excited people to try 
to try uh, Fun Forge beer. <laughs> so, uh, all right, we're gonna try some beer. What do we got? Uh, you know what, y'all? Ball and Raspberry Provincial. I think I need one. Let's half try one of those. Uh, you know what? I can do a half. I'll do the same. I'm pace myself. It is GABF. We gotta move slowly through uh, the week. So, all right, guys. We uh, we're gonna enjoy some of these raspberry provincials, and uh, you guys get a chance to try fun course wherever you're at. If you ever get a chance to come to ABF, uh, it's a short drive up to Fort Collins yeah. to uh, have some beer. So, so cheers, Gordon. Cheers. Thanks for taking the tour. <laughs>